Oh, that actually worked semi-smoothly. So my dad and I are on a little trip to the north end of Vancouver Island right now. And now today, we are on the way back home and I am looking for a brown trout or a dolly varden. I just had a brown bite my crankbait. Oh my God. I saw a substantial surface over here that looked like it might have been from a fish chasing something. I paddled over here and second cast with this little crankbait. I just saw what looked like a 14, 15 inch brown uh, flash and hit my lure. It's possible it was a cutthroat, but it looked very dark. Oh, he just hit again or something else just hit. Got him. I've got one. Oh, there he goes. It was a cutthroat. Uh, there's multiple fish here though. I hooked two in the same cast there. And this, the one that I uh, just lost right beside the boat was like a, I don't know, 10 inch, 11 inch cutthroat, but it was quite wide. I've got a brown and he's going absolutely nuts. It's a decent fish too. He is just doing the, oh, he's barely hooked. I'm going to really not put too much pressure here. Oh. Come on, buddy. Got him. That is not a bad little brown trout. Should keep him in the water here. There he is. Have, have a look at that beautiful little brown trout. And I'm gonna get him right back into the water. There he goes. Nice, beautiful browns like that in here. And there theoretically are also some Dolly Varden, or at least it's a possibility, but I have not caught any yet. I sure as hell would like to in this tiny little lake, a Dolly Varden would be pretty cool. And this one feels bigger. It definitely could be bigger. It took drag right at the start. Oh yeah, that's a good one. That is a pretty good one. I don't think he's too, too much bigger, but he's an inch or two bigger. That's a good fish. And it's another brown for sure. Okay, buddy, okay. Got him. Jesus, okay. That is another beautiful brown trout. Oh, and he does not like the net. Now just have a look at that fish right there. And we will put him right back. Wow. I have landed two nice brown trout. So, I'm betting there might be some more in here. I might get a third. Because I'm only just at the beginning of the stretch that I caught the 17 incher last time that I was here. And I've caught two 14 inches right at the beginning of that. I would not be surprised if there's another fish in here for me. It's a little windy, so that's awkward, but I can deal with it. You know, I find it quite funny 
So many serious fishermen on Vancouver Island that I've talked to seem to think that there's no browns or the only place there is browns is Cowich and River and that's pretty much it. Um, but I know of at least three lakes and maybe there is even more than that and a handful of water and a handful of river systems that are mostly connected to those lakes that have browns. And, you know, this is the most surprising place of them all, because this is the most tiny, middle-of-nowhere lake you can basically get. And I've caught a 17-inch brown in here. And there is a... Uh, like, 20-year-old or 10-year-old stocking report pulled a 7-pound brown trout out of this lake. Oh my god! Holy shit. That's another brown, I'm pretty sure. That thing hit like a train. What was he doing? Oh no, I think... Is that a cutthroat? That might be... Yeah, that's a cutthroat. Oh. I'm just gonna try and lift this guy into the boat, because I'm tired of... getting... All tangled up. Yeah, that's a cutty. That's a cutty. That's a cutty. That is a cutty for sure. Have a look at that pretty little fish. Very dark colored. Very dark for a cutthroat. There he goes. I just saw a fish surface right beside the pads. Could be a brown. And I made a perfect cast. Oh, got him. Yep, there he is. It looks like a cutthroat, I think. That's hilarious. I saw him surface inches from the pads. And then I cast in there and he took. Pretty sure it's a cutthroat. Um, yep, it is a little cutty. Oh, man. <laughs> I'm gonna have to try and get myself away from the uh, pads here. Jesus Christ. Oh, there he goes. He's off. That's better anyway. So that was a little, maybe 10 inch cutthroat, but he uh, was hooked a little sideways so he felt heavier and he uh, surfaced right, right in there and I cast over him and hooked him. That's funny. Had any luck? Nothing. Really? Um, I, uh, Landed two 14-inch browns. 